All right, we are live here in the YouTube room, the Car Pavilion YouTube room, and we are going to go ahead and open up the three box mixer here. But before I do that, I just want to make sure that everyone knows what teams they have before we begin. So, Chris L., you have the Arizona Diamondbacks. Tom L., you got the Colorado Rockies. Danny Supreme has the San Diego Padres. Crazy Bear with the Red Sox. Todd W. with the Miami Marlins. Carlos with the Pittsburgh Pirates. S. Rob Joe with the Dodgers. Crazy Bear with the Yankees. Penny with the A's, Oakland A's, that is. S. Rob Joe with the San Francisco Giants. Skiing has the Milwaukee Brewers and the New York Mets. S. Rob Joe, Minnesota Twins. Crazy Bear with the Washington Nationals. Dylan J with the Chicago White Sox. Crazy Bear has the Toronto Blue Jays. Skiing with the Tampa Bay Rays. Dave W with the Hometown Angels. Crazy Bear with the Texas Rangers. Gary Instagary with the Detroit Tigers. Skiing has the Baltimore Orioles. Cards R Us, Philadelphia Phillies. Chris L with the Chicago Cubs. Cards R Us with the Cleveland Indians. Wegwin with the Cardinals, Tom L with the Mariners, JMP27 with the Braves, Skian with the Astros, Penny with the Reds, and to round it off, Christian with the Kansas City Royals. All right, we got that out of the way. All right, here we go. <laughs> Penny is asking already if, if Skian's in the room, will you trade the Brewers? So everyone, good luck. And we'll start off, I think we're gonna go this way. We're gonna need to start off with the inception, then we'll hit Top Strong, and then we'll end up with Top Tribute Baseball. All right, so good luck everyone. I hope everyone's doing well. I know I haven't seen a, or been in the room in a couple of days. But let's see what we get here. Starting off with the Top's Inception Baseball. Holders in place. Danny Supreme and Penny, I see. They're live on the chat right now. All right. Good luck, everyone. Starting off with 2020 Tops Inception Baseball. This is a three box mixer, random teams. There's the empty box. And the one pack that guarantees to have the autograph or autograph relic inside. So everyone, good luck. Let's see what we hit here. I haven't opened this up in a couple couple weeks. Got rid of, yeah, we actually blew through a lot of the this product when it all came out. Oops, let me go ahead and get this out of the way. So starting off, the Oakland A's, we got a red bordered Sean Murphy rookie card. Just use that real quick. So starting off, Oakland Days gets the first hit out of the break. Sean Murphy, that is a rookie, number to 75. There you go. Not sure if this is 120. There's the 120s. So there you go. Congratulations, Oakland. Starting us off, second hit, Javi Baez. That is a green bordered card. The all-star second baseman for the Chicago Cubs. There you go. Best card up after that, we have a rookie card for the Cleveland Indians. Cleveland Indians rookie card, Bobby Bradley. There you go. There you go, Cleveland spot. Next card up after that, we have the San Diego Padres base card of Fernando Tati. Padres spot for, I believe that's Danny Supreme. Danny Supreme has the San Diego Padres in this break. So there you go, Danny Supreme. Congratulations there. 
Moving on, we got another rookie card for the Oakland A's, Sheldon Noose. There you go. Open days. Oakland A's are owned by Penny. Penny, that's your card. And the Chicago Cubs with the Javi Baez. That is Chris L's spot there. And as we're moving on, we got the Boston Red Sox. Boston Red Sox base card of Mookie Betts. Obviously, he's now a former Red Sox, Red Sox, and he's now with the Dodgers. And the autograph for the Washington Natural, Nationals out of this break. Goes to, so the autograph goes to the Washington Nationals. Just quick, who has the Nationals in this break? Washington Nationals. Crazy Bear gets the first autograph of the day or the night. Card number to 245, Carter Kaboom. So there you go, Crazy Bear. Congratulations on that. Carter Kaboom, I'm sorry. Autograph, number to 245. There you go. Awesome. Carter Kaboom. First autograph out of the Topps Inception Baseball. <laughs> the A's, I think, yeah. Penny, you do have the A's. All right. Moving on. Let's, does it matter? I don't know if anyone matters. Do you want to do Topps Tribute or Topps Chrome Sapphire? They're both about the same price right now. <laughs> but there's more hits out of the Topps Tribute, so I guess we'll go Topps Chrome Sapphire. Top Storm Sapphire is on. Sapphire is on fire. Stuff is over four hundred dollars a box, I believe now, which is nuts. But uh, yeah, one autograph per box that's guaranteed. Well, one rookie autograph that's guaranteed out of this. And uh, yeah, some of the um, Sapphire cards, of Fernando Tatis, some of the big name superstars, Mike Trout would be good. <laughs> Penny using the hashtag NBB. There you go. So here's a new box of Top Chrome Sapphire. Good luck, everyone, on this portion of the break. There's the empty box. Use the Top Tribute box to have them all up here. All right. We'll just get my penny sleeves ready. And let's see what we get. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight packs, four cards each. All right. Good luck, everyone. Everyone's on the wrong one. Let me, give me one second. Soul, welcome to the room. I just texted you. Yeah, I wonder if Ian couldn't get in. That's my bad. Let me give me one second here. There he is. Let me go and go over the teams for the two guys that just came in the room. Ian, welcome in. And Saul, welcome in. So, Ian, you have the Brewers and Mets, Rays, Orioles, and Astros. So, Astros, O's, Rays, Mets, and Brewers. And Cards Are Us, also known as Saul. Cards Are Us, you have the Pirates, Phillies, and the Indians. We have those three teams in this break. All right. 
<laughs> Ian got the entire division, huh? Oh, man. All right. So now we opened up the first box, which was a Topps Inception baseball. The autograph out of that box was went to Crazy Beer. You had the Washington Nationals in this break. You got the Carter Kaboom autograph. And now we just opened up the Topps Chrome Sapphire. Still haven't, op haven't opened up any packs. So we'll go ahead and start that right now. Legwin, are you asking? Legwin, are you asking what team you have? Let me make sure. Sorry. And Wegwin. Wegwin, I think you got one spot in the break. You got the St. Louis Cardinals. Wegwin, you have the St. Louis Cardinals in this break. <laughs> Danny Supreme says you got the Giants in this break. <laughs> All right. Good luck. First pack of 2019 Tops Chrome Sapphire Baseball. Let's see what we got out of this. All right. Robbie Erlin's first card. Rookie card of Garrett Hampson for the Colorado Rockies. Garrett Hampson's a local kid. I believe he's from Long Beach State, so he's a dirtbag. And just making sure the, the Colorado Rockies. Colorado Rockies are owned by Tom L. So that Tom L, that's your Garrett Hampson there. Chicago Cubs, John Lester. Lefty pitcher for the Chicago Cubs. And the last card out of here. Kansas City Royals, Hunter Dozier. All right. So the highlight out of that first pack was the rookie card of Garrett Hampson. Yep. Danny Supreme, you got the you got the Padres in this break. I don't know if you've seen the prices on the Tatises. Good luck to you on that. And I, I want to say I've seen them at 600 plus. So first card out of pack number two for the Angels, Jaime Berea. I believe that's Tom L. Cleveland Indians, Adam Pletko. Let me go and just sleeve these up real quick. <laughs> Detroit Tigers, Gary Instagary, Jordan Zimmerman. And for the Pittsburgh Pirates, Cards Are Us, this is you, Starling Marte. So this is your card here. There you go, Cards Are Us. Give me one second, guys. All right, on to pack number three, here we go. <laughs> awesome, Ian. Uh, that's all. That's all I've heard. That it's really, really a lot, so much better. So, yeah, it was a no-brainer. Everyone, yeah, was getting upset about how it just kept on lagging on Instagram, unfortunately. So here's Dan Straley, Miami Marlins. Still looking for the autograph. Pablo Sandoval for the Giants. And for the Padres, here's the rookie card of Jacob Nix. <laughs> Danny Supreme, I don't think you're looking for Jacob Nix. And for the Milwaukee Brewers, Ian, this is yours, Orlando Arcia. <laughs> there you go. All right, next pack. Good luck, everybody. <laughs> Here's the Philadelphia Phillies, Jake Arietta. Base card. Here's the Jose Martinez. 
for the St. Louis Cardinals. Wegman, this is yours. St. Louis Cardinals is your team in this break. Here's a rookie card for the Minnesota Twins. Cole Stewart. I know we opened this, this product a couple weeks ago. Cole Stewart was an autograph out of two of the boxes, I believe. Let me just see who has the Minnesota Twins in this break. Minnesota Twins, S. Rob Joe, this is your card. Congratulations there. Got a rookie card of Cole Stewart. Yes, you were one of them, Danny Supreme. And the last card from the Houston Astros, Hector Rondon. Houston Astros. Ian, is that one of your teams? Houston? Houston Astros is skiing. It is. So, Ian, that's your card there. Got four packs to go, which is included in this one that I have in my hand. Aaron Sanchez on the back there. And here's a Windy, C Windy City Warriors card for the Chicago Cubs. Chicago Cubs is owned by Chris L. in this break. So this Chris L., that's your card. And here's the auto, guys, for the Atlanta Braves, an autographed rookie card of Tuki Toussaint. Tuki Toussaint autograph. Atlanta Braves, JMP27. That's your card there. That's the last spot. Mojo right there. JMP27. He bought the last spot to close out the break. So JMP27, Jose, congratulations. And the last two cards out of the pack, Tommy Pham, Tampa Bay Rays. And then I believe Crazy Bear has the Yankees in this break. So Crazy Bear, this is your uh, Gary Sanchez if I'm not mistaken. Let me just make sure on that before I move on. New York Yankees, Crazy Bear. So that is correct. And the Rays were owned by Skiing, so the Tommy Pham is yours, Ian. All right, so we hit the autograph. Hopefully we got something low numbered or a big big rookie card. <laughs> Maritza Ruiz. Just on the name, am I good, $100? For the Baltimore Orioles, here's the rookie card of Austin Wins. Austin Wins. Baltimore Orioles. Baltimore's owned by Skiing in this break. So Skiing, that is your card. There you go. Nate Jones, Chicago White Sox. Dylan, that's your card there. Nate Jones, congratulations. Here's a Nick Tropiano. For the hometown angels, that goes to Tom. Tom, that's your card there. Thank you for joining us today on the break. And for the Red Sox, Eduardo Nunez. Eduardo Nunez, Boston. That's Crazy Bear again. Crazy Bear, that's your card there. <laughs> All right, two more packs to go. We did hit the autograph, and I'm, I think we should be a numbered card at least in here. Hopefully it's something big. All right. Philadelphia Phillies. There is Roman Quinn. Roman Quinn base card. Miami Marlins. Miami is owned by Todd. Todd, this is your card here. Kyle Bearclaw. That's a base card. Here is a numbered card for the Pittsburgh Pirates. Pittsburgh is owned by Cards R Us in this break, I believe. And it's a Stephen Brault. Pittsburgh. Cards R Us, this is your card. So, congratulations, Stephen Brault, number to 25. You can see that there. And uh, Tampa Bay Rays, here's a rookie card of uh, Brandon Lowe. 
pretty sure he had a pretty decent season for the Rays last year. And Tampa Bay, of course, that's Ian. Ian, congratulations there on the rookie card. <laughs> and last pack out of the top Chrome Sapphire. Good luck, everyone. Corey Seager on the back for the Dodgers. And on the front for the Rockies, base card of Sung Hui Ho. Sung Kwan Ho. There you go, Rockies. Next card up for the Dodgers, Pedro Baez. I know Danny Supreme, we're we're running out of we're running out of cards here. The Dodgers are owned by S. Rob Joe in this break. So there you go, Dodgers. You got this card, and then there's another card coming up. And I know that because it was on the back of the pack. It was Corey Seager. But in between that, here's for the Yankees, Brett Gardner. So there's a Brett Gardner for the Yankees. The Yankees are owned by Car I'm sorry, Crazy Bear. Crazy Bear, congratulations there. And then S. Rob Joe, here's your second card out of the pack for the Dodgers, Corey Seager. So there you go. So that was Topps Chrome Sapphire. Let me just show you the two hits we got out of there. So Cards Are Us. You got this here, the Pittsburgh Pirates. Orange Refractor, number 25 of Stephen Brault. And then JMP27, Atlanta Braves autograph, Tuki Toussaint rookie autograph. So there you go there. Congratulations on that. <laughs> the bias so Chris isn't in the room I don't believe so I could ask him later on where I'm, I'm sure he is probably sleeping <laughs> even Penny's using Vietnamese dollars now all right last box good luck everybody this is probably the biggest one obviously with Three on-card autographs and three game used memorabilia cards per box. So, the last box out of the break, got a three-box mixer. Let's see what we have here. Hi, Zach. Zach, welcome to the room. Zach is feel the burn on Instagram. <laughs> Tristan, we've been missing you. Zach, since you're in the room here, let me just show you the two autographs out of the two previous boxes real quick. Out of Topps Inception, Crazy Bear hit the Carter Kaboom. And this is his card. This is an autograph card, number 245. And out of the Top Sapphire, we just finished opening up the autograph out of there was an autograph rookie card of Tuki Toussaint going to JMP27. And now we're about to open the last box, and this is Topps Tribute Baseball. Topps Tribute Baseball. I haven't done this in a while. This is what we had started on, I want to say. When, when this first came out, that's when I started going live on Instagram. So bringing back memories after. There's the six packs there. Everyone, good luck. <laughs> Kaboom! All right, everyone, good luck. Let's see what we going to get here. Six hits out of this. Let's see which team get the hits. Penny, I don't know if you see that there. There's a yellow upside down. <laughs> Ian, you love these cards? Yeah, I do too, man. So the hits in the middle. And we'll start off with a Carl Yastrzemski for the for the Boston Red Sox. There you go, Boston. Boston and Crazy Bear. That's the base card for you. Let me just get some sleeves out for this.
Obviously, I just said that. Here's a Yelich base card on the back. Ian, congratulations there. And the hit out of this pack. Let's see who we got. For the Milwaukee Brewers. Brewers, are, is that Ian? Ian with the first hit out of here. How about a Kessin Hira autograph? Number 111 of 199. There you go, Ian. Boom. It's a nice young player. For the Milwaukee Brewers. So you got the Yelich and you got the Kessin Hira out of this pack. So congratulations there. Really good first autograph out of the box. Let's see how the rest of the box goes with five packs remaining. Pack number two, everyone, out of Top Tribute Baseball. Good luck. First card up is for the Seattle Mariners. I'm just checking real quick. Seattle Mariners is owned by Tom. You get a you get a rookie card of Kyle Lewis. There's only two of these per case, I believe. So there's one of the one of the two. Comes out of this box here. Tom, congratulations there on the Kyle Lewis rookie card. On the back. We have a base card of J.D. Martinez for the Boston Red Sox. Boston is owned by Crazy Bear. So, Crazy Bear, that's your card. And the hit out of this pack. Let's see which way this goes. All right. For the Houston Astros, Stamp of approval, Garrett Cole. That's a stamp of approval relic card With the, when he was with the Houston Astros, number to 99. Houston Astros, I believe, is owned by Ian. Let me just make sure on that. Houston Astros. Houston Astros. Ian. Ian, this is your card. Congratulations on the hit there. All right, there you go. There's a local kid there. Just went, he went to high school down the street from the shop. All right, here's pack number three out of the six pack box. Everyone good luck. So the first card up for the Mets. Is a Jeff McNeil. Ian, I believe this is your card too. I believe you had back to back teams and Met, the Mets were one of them. Let me just make sure on that. Yeah, you had the Brewers and the Mets back to back, Ian. So that's yours there. On the back side, White Sox base card of Yoan Mancata. The White Sox are owned by Dylan. So, Dylan, this is your card. <laughs> That's good to hear, Tristan. I like hearing that. <laughs> Does anyone else buy into the break besides Ian? <laughs> yeah, Tristan, I heard that a lot of feedback uh, of that, about that, saying that the, the clarity on the, on the YouTube channel is so much better. All right, let's see what's the hit out of this. And this is for the Cincinnati Reds, a Trevor Bauer autograph, number to 99. Trevor Bauer, Cincinnati Reds. Penny, is that you, the Reds? I know you said go Reds earlier. Cincinnati Reds. I can't find them right now.
Penny, Cincinnati Reds. There you are. There you go. Congratulations there. There's a Trevor Bauer autograph, number to 99. And that's half the box there. So you still got a couple more hits to go. And the breakdown on that looks like uh, the first three packs, two autos and the one relic. So let's see what else we have here. Penny, congratulations on the Trevor Bauer. All right. Pack number four, Boston Red Sox base card of Chris Sale. There you go. There you go, Boston. On the back side, Houston Astros. Houston Astros, I believe, is Ian again. Jose Altuve. There you go. And the hit out of pack number four is upside down. Let's turn this back over. And there's a tribute. Oh, <laughs> boom. How about this? This is a Lou Ruiz Robert autograph number to 50. <laughs> Dylan, this is your card, buddy. Congratulations. One of the hot top rookies. And this brings me back to when we start opening these packs. And uh, was it Ian that had, Ian, was it you that hit two autographs in one pack of Luis Robert? Dylan, congratulations. That's a big hit right there. Yeah, yeah, I do remember that. Look at that. Number 39 of 50. So, Dylan, congratulations. That is awesome. So, we've got the three autographs. And let's see what the rest of the box is. This pack felt thicker. It looks like there's an extra card in here. So let's see what that is. On the top here, we got a base card of Whit Merrifield. Whit Merrifield. Top tribute. Kansas City Royals. Kansas City Royals is Christian. Christian, that's your card there. Congratulations. On the back, for the Cubs, we got a green parallel, number to 99. Of Anthony Rizzo. There you go, Chris. Chris L. That's yours. That's a green parallel. Of Riz, number to 99. And behind that, we got an Al Alex Bregman for the Houston Astros. Ian, that's your card there. Base card of Alex Bregman. Let's see if I can fix that. There you go. And the hit out of this pack. <laughs> For the Yankees. Yankees, Crazy Bear, this is yours. A dual relic card of Giancarlo Stanton and Aaron Judge, number to 150. Congratulations there. Dual relic card, Aaron Judge and Giancarlo Stanton. There you go. Go put that in that stack there. All right. And everyone, this is the last pack out of the break. Good luck. <laughs> Ian, are you saying damn because of that card? Out of the couple boxes you opened up, you have you didn't get that card. All right, last pack, everyone. Good luck. Just move this here. Help out there. So the first card on top, base card of Mike Messina with the Baltimore Orioles. Baltimore's owned by Ian. So Ian, that's your card. On the back side, for the Yankees, a base card of Roger Maris. Roger Maris, base card. Yankees, Crazy Bear, that short card there. Congratulations. With 
Crazy Bear with the hit. All right. And the last hit out of the break, going to the Chicago Cubs. Here's a triple relic of Anthony Rizzo, numbered to 150. So, Chris, that's your card there. Congratulations. Chris L. had the, he had the Cubs in this break. Another Rizzo. Earlier in the box, he hit the uh, green parallel of Anthony Rizzo, number to 99. So there you go. All right, let me just get these all together, and then we can do the recap here on the on the tribute baseball. All right. Guys, thank you so much. I appreciate you joining us on this break. It did take a little while to fill, but that's all right. But, uh, here are the hits. Anthony Rizzo that we just saw, number to 150. Triple Relic card. This is going to the Cubs and Chris L. All Relic uh, for the Yankees. Dual Relic for the Yankees going to Crazy Bear. Dual Relic of Aaron Judge and Giancarlo Stanton, number to 150. Crazy Bear, congratulations and thank you. Skiing, this is yours, a stamp of approval. Garrett Cole, that's a green parallel relic card, number to 99. When he was with the Astros and now he's with your favorite team, the Yankees. That's your card there. Tom, this is your rookie card of Kyle Lewis, Seattle Mariners rookie, number to 450. And Tom, thank you for purchasing into the breaks. Appreciate it. Here's a green Trevor Bauer going to Penny. 32 of 99, Trevor Bauer autograph. Penny, thank you, and congratulations there. Ian, this is yours. This was the first, first hit out of this box when we start opening it. Kessin Hira autograph, number to 199. 111 of 199. And Dylan, Dylan got the nice hit out of this, this box, so probably the whole break. A Luis Robert, autograph number to 50. So, Dylan, thank you very much. I know that's the first time you bought into the break, and congratulations there. <laughs> Crazy Otto, yeah. Guys, I don't know. I, I could Let me bring out some of the products, whatever I have left here, and then, uh, yeah, we could have a little open forum. Little open form of what we have, so thank you very much. Let me just put this aside. Are there any big basketball fans in the room? Anyone go go out and try to get some first off the line basketball cards? Mosaic. As I put out the uh, brake pad of basketball players with Zion in the middle there. Still a little bit of the same stuff I've had over the last couple of weeks. See what we have here. There's Tops Update Baseball. Let me get some more music playing here. Still got some Topps Chrome Sapphire. It does. I think it pre-sells tomorrow, actually, Penny. 
if I'm not mistaken. I did see that. I think it was today. It was the uh, first offline mosaic, and then tomorrow is the select first offline. So there's some more top chrome sapphire. Got some tops inception baseball there. And then, uh, yeah, last couple boxes of Topps Tribute Baseball. If anyone wants a three-way on or anything like that. But yeah, there it is. Got Topps Chrome, Topps Chrome Sapphire, another box up there. We got Bowman Draft Sapphire. There's Topps Tribute Baseball with Mike Trout there. We got the Topps Update from 2019, and then Bowman Heritage, that guarantees one autograph, and then it, it, Inception Baseball, that guarantees an autograph or autograph patch. This one here, Zach? Zach, these go for, um, this goes for 125 a box on the top's update it's the first vladimir guerrero numbered card because in series two he did have a no numbered card and there were no parallels he's in there and casting Hira. so 125 a box on that and then draft sapphire penny so that that's the last one here i actually started bringing stuff back to the shop and i brought probably a half a case I back to the shop. So that's the last, last box I have here, but I have plenty in the shop. And then Bowman Draft Sapphire there, Penny. That goes for 260 a box. 260 on the Bowman Draft Sapphire. Right there. Tribute. There you go there. That's some decent stuff. That's still half a case right there. <laughs> Penny, yeah. Adley is possible out of that Bowman Draft Sapphire. There's no autographs in Draft Sapphire, but there's two numbered parallels or refractors. That would be sweet if it was an, a numbered Adley. This is actually exciting right now. There's so much stuff that's coming out over the next couple of weeks. Uh, 2020 Bowman Baseball, if anyone's keeping up with that, that stuff is on fire. 2020 Bowman Baseball, I think the blowout cards has them pre-selling at 485 a jumbo and 260 I believe. They're sold out now because I just looked before I went live. But And, yeah, the, the jumbos were at 485 last time I checked. That's per jumbo box and the hobby, which is one autograph per box. They were for 250, 260. And that stuff is nuts. And anyone that's seen the um, Jason Dominguez autograph from the first edition, Bowman first edition, that thing's at $16,000. And so that one's numbered to 99. Yeah, I mean, Zach, we've talked about, we've spoken about that with those pieces. I think the best bet for anybody is just to take a chance by getting into a break and you hope you hit the Yankees or, or the Royals. Now, I'm sure there's other guys I miss. I, I think Poisson for the A's, he's another big prospect. I think Sam Huff for the Rangers is another guy. They're all Bowman first cards, and I'm assuming they'll all have uh, Bowman first autographs. Yeah, Penny. Yeah, 16,000 and counting on that card. Yeah, that is wild. And then I just got wind that Mosaic, which comes out uh, next week. Now, obviously, we just talked about that. They went, they went, and sold out at six fifty a box on Penny's website with the first off the line. The hobby boxes are. I heard that they, because of production with COVID nineteen, the the amount of Mosaic basketball that was made it was actually half of 
prism and optic. So we'll see if that's true. And if that is true and um, there's a liking to those cards, that product's going to be really, really expensive too. So Jose, yes, I am. Jose, I am getting that. I'm getting that one release day. I believe last time I checked, it was May 22nd. So I'm getting one box of Hobby and I'm getting a box of Blasters. I'm sorry, a case of Hobby and a case of Blasters. And I've seen them selling, pre-selling for as much as $600 a Hobby box. So if that's true from what I heard, if the, if the production on that is a lot more limited, now it's going to be really hot as well. If anyone does hockey, SP Authentic, hockey's coming out here on the 27th. That's probably one of the more popular products in hockey every year. Penny, yes, Mosaic is basketball. So I don't, I, I think you told me that you're not a big basketball fan. But Prism is king in basketball. I haven't checked. I think the last time I checked it was at 800, Zach. So when your your Sky Blue Jason Dominguez is at $1,000 already with a couple of days left. Wow. And so how how are those selling on eBay? I mean, if you look on the comps, just wondering. The bad thing, so retail hit first on the Mosaic basketball. And on the retail side, there's a lot of there's a lot of prisms in there, but there's not a lot of numbered cards. Where hobby is gonna have a bunch or a plethora of of numbered cards, and that's where uh, the hobby is right now. Obviously, the more limited it is, the better it is. <laughs> Wegman, whatever happened to that four thousand dollar offer that when we were talking about that that Friday or Saturday night when we were back in the room? Did you ever talk to your buddy about that? Yeah, that's a that's a cool offer right there. Auto bid. Eighty dollars in the base. Oh, wow. Danny Supreme, are you still in the room? You want to buy that? You want to buy the Jason Dominguez? The other one goes for forty dollars. Oh, he's gone already. Where do you go? <laughs> he really wanted to get the uh, Fernando Tatis. <laughs> I didn't know that. That was a that was a deal you guys had in place. Could have had that.
<laughs> Goes to the Todd Van Poppel pile. Todd Van Poppel at one point was talked about as being the next Nolan Ryan. Ian, thank you. Thank you for joining us. I appreciate it. Have a good night. <laughs> Teddy's trying to trade uh, David Cohn for Kessin Hira. Penny knew. <laughs> Penny's asking who's popping what here. <laughs> what are you guys doing? Showing off all your Milwaukee Brewers cards? Hits, RCs, and inserts. That's cool. Penny, weren't, aren't you starting to do that type of stuff too? I saw your Instagram page earlier. <laughs> no playing cards? I notice a lot of people are doing that. I have one customer who's been doing that. Or I noticed that he was doing. he's been doing a virtual... Baseball card show, which is kind of cool during the pandemic. They destroyed you. <laughs> Was that really playing cards? You guys actually, there's an app or there's a website to do playing cards? Unless it's Poker Stars or something like that. <laughs> <laughs> you guys use real baseball cards? <laughs> we should have a poker night. Oh, man.
I'll be there in four days. Oh, man. I don't know, that'll be the days. It'll be, it'll be fun to hang out with anybody again. That will be fun. <laughs> Sunday it is, baby. Too bad it's not on Friday when your Jason Dominguez PSA 10 ends. Wigwin, it's funny that you ask about Scooter. So one of my other customers, he asked about Scooter. Have I talked to him? And I told him I don't have his cell phone number. I never thought I'd need it. I didn't know that we were going to go into lockdown. But yeah, he was asking about him. I was like, I wish I did have his number so I could just see how he's doing. <laughs> we bring the mask. <laughs> he's baiting me. Oh, man. That'd be funny if Scooter actually is a really good card player. <laughs> yeah, me too. I hope he is okay. I hope his family's okay. Could you imagine? I, we talk about it. I know it's in good fun, but... Being quarantined with Scooter. Oh, man. That's why he loved coming to the shop once or twice a week. It was just that was his outlet to, to hang out for a couple hours. Now I haven't seen the guy in almost two months. Sorry about that. Just changing the music a little bit, guys. <laughs> He's the people's champion. <laughs> <laughs> Jenny, you're out of here already? Oh, man. So, Penny, I take it that that was – those are the pools you were talking about earlier or that you had posted? So those guys went through your stuff? <laughs> Hope you guys got some really good cards. Clean it <laughs> That was round one. <laughs> wow. Literally one round. <laughs> you should make those guys fly you out here, Penny. They're taking you out like that.
So who'd you get? You got a one number to 10 and uh, another one number to 50? I take it. I know that Penny only does all baseball, so it's definitely baseball only. <laughs> now you gotta send them to the mail ground through Philadelphia. <laughs> Corey Seager, number to one of ten. Is that an autograph? Tondras Artist Group. Cool. That's a cool card. Definitely could use them probably here better than you can back back in PA since he's a Dodger. No one wants to do uh, no one wants to break a share a box of tribute baseball. Got three boxes left of that. Oh, okay. Penny, are those for the uh, Yelich's? Both your cards are Dodgers. Sal. Oh, that's cool. <laughs> do, you, do, you, do you need some of the drafts, Bowman Draft Sapphire at some point? You let me know. Hopefully, I still have them in stock. Hopefully, just because there's no autographs, I don't think they'll ever reach these Sapphire levels. These are crazy now. I remember buying these for a lot cheaper than 400 plus. But yeah, I think, yeah, these, these definitely jumped up too. I remember buying these for a lot less than what they're going for now, 260 a box.
All right, Wayne Gwynn, thank you very much. Have a good night. All right, Saul, you as well. Thank you very much for buying in. Penny, I'm going to sign off, but I, I could talk to you on my phone if you don't mind. That's that's cool. I, I could go ahead and do some of the stuff around the house here. <laughs> I, how much do they go for? How much do the Adleys and the out of the Bowman Sapphire, the Bowman Draft Sapphire go for? I'll tell you what, we could talk about that via text message, Penny. But uh, yeah, I'd, obviously, the easy answer is always buy the single. They go for that much now? Oh, man. I remember when that card was on like a $20, $30 card. Interesting. Penny, I'll, I'm going to go ahead and end the stream. Thank you very much for joining, and then we can talk offline. And everyone, thank you very much. And the next time I probably see you, will probably be in the next week or two. I'm going to decide on the new products that are coming out, if I'm going to go ahead and break or if we're going to go ahead and just uh, – I'm sure we'll break at least a couple cases of the Bowman. I got a lot of Bowman coming in. That's going to be really hot. We're going to be looking for Jason Dominguez. Jason Dominguez autograph is going to take care of someone's, someone's mortgage for the next couple of weeks there. So the next – I'm sorry, next couple of months. You get a, imagine if we hit a super fracture of someone. That would be fun. That would be awesome. So, uh, yeah, like I said, those boxes and cases are going for huge amounts of money now on the pre-sale market. Can't wait to see that uh, live out and about. Mosaic, like I talked about earlier, Mosaic is crazy as well. But, uh, yeah, we'll definitely talk, the next time we talk, we'll definitely have more product or newer product out here on the market. So thank you very much for joining us, and we'll talk again soon. Good night.